Like and subscribe right now or you're going to have bad luck for the rest of the week. There's so many weird animals on planet Earth. We could make a video that lasts for hours talking about all of them. But who has time for that, really? So we've taken the time for you and chosen 10 of the weirdest animals we could find to look at in this video. Number one will definitely give you the creeps. Let's go. 10 weird animals that will give you chills. Number 10. I I. The first entry on our list could be described as cute and weird looking at the same time. This primate, going by the name of I I, is often considered an animal that gives you a mixed feeling when you look at it. Is it cute? Is it ugly? Well, some would say both. This lemur has large eyes that seem like they could see right into your soul and long, slender fingers used for getting bugs out of small holes. In Madagascar, the natives have many legends and tales revolving around the I I. One of them is that if the primate points at you, you are marked for impending death, and you have no other choice than to hunt down the harmless animal to avoid your fate. It is also believed that seeing an eye eye is an ill omen, which is why they are often killed on sight. This and natural habitat destruction have driven the population into the endangered species list. What do you think about the eye eye? Does it deserve its bad reputation? Number 9. Cereal Leaf Beetle in this instance, it is not the adult beetle that is the weird-looking one, but rather the larvae. This odd animal gives anyone that looks at it the creeps. It is often found looking like it has more larvae inside of its body, but that isn't actually what it is. They are actually filled with fecal pellets, which are used against prey. Just imagine you were a ladybug. You really wouldn't like to eat this pest. You probably wondered why we said pest, but there is a good reason to describe this beetle as one. The cereal leaf beetle, also called CLB, is a very problematic pest in cereal. CLB larvae and adults feed on the newest leaves on plants and remove long strips of the surface. Usually, the damage they do is insignificant. Yet, some farmers may lose 25% of their harvest due to the timing or duration of this infestation. Stressed and poorly developed plants increase the chance of potential damage. So not only does this larvae look weird, but it is also among the most dangerous pests next to something as damaging as locusts. Number 8. Great Potu if you look at pictures of the great potu online, it seems like the bird was photoshopped to look this derpy, but these birds are very much real. Something to keep in mind is that their most famous pictures only became famous because they caught the potu bird at the silliest possible moment or the worst possible angle. The great potu is a species of bird that lives in Central and South America. The great thing about this bird is that it uses camouflage as a way to avoid predators. Their colors and markings make it easy for the bird to pose as a big branch. That is, of course, if it doesn't open its eyes or move. The thing here is, though, that it doesn't have to open its eyes to see. Yes, you heard that right. The Great Potu has special notches on its upper eyelids that allow it to see and detect movements, even when its eyes are closed. Pretty cool, isn't it? Number 7. Madagascar Leaf-Nosed Snake just like our number 10 entry, the I.I., this little guy also lives on the island of Madagascar. There are quite a couple of weird-looking animals in that specific ecosystem, isn't there? Well, this snake belongs to the more crazy-looking of its species. The Madagascar leaf-nosed snake got its name from its nose, which, fitting with its name, looks like the tip of a leaf. It does look a bit odd, but most would say that it isn't as bad compared to other animals. This snake hunts by sitting and waiting until prey comes along. While stalking their prey, it may hang down from a branch and swing gently, most likely to mimic a hanging vine. This makes the snake almost invisible to its victim, giving it the advantage of surprise. These snakes are usually calm and don't bite, unless provoked. Their venom causes severe pain in humans, but is not deadly. Number 6. Snails at first glance, snails don't seem all that unusual. Many people even have little snails as pets, and the snails live out their lives happily. What is unsettling about this entry is that there is a specific parasite that invades their body to achieve its personal goal. This worm is called the Leucochloridium, which is just way too much of a mouthful. So from now on, we will refer to it as the Green Banded Brood Sac, or GBB for short. This parasite invades the snail's eye stalk, where it makes itself pulsate to imitate a caterpillar and attract birds. The goal is to attract a bird to eat the snail's eye stalk. If the bird does so, the parasite will be able to breed in the bird's gut and release their eggs into the bird's feces. The snail passing by is happy to eat up the droppings of the bird, and the whole bizarre cycle begins again. The worm has a problem, though. Snails are mainly nocturnal, and the birds they are targeting, which hunt by sight, most certainly are not. It begins manipulating the behavior of the snail. 
forcing it out into the dangers of the light of day, where predators swarm. That is why these snails are often referred to as zombie snails. Number 5. Lamprey the lamprey fish is definitely something you would see in your nightmares or in a horror movie. While this parasitic fish doesn't pose much threat to humans, it still isn't something we would get in the water with. This fish has rows of teeth aligned in circles and can move its jaw almost however it wants. Usually, it preys on fish by latching onto them, sucking the fish's blood. Adults of other species of lampreys are more directly carnivorous. In a similar fashion to the parasitic lamprey, the carnivorous lamprey also swims up to a fish and latches onto it with its circular mouth. But rather than lap up blood, it eats through the fish's flesh with its raspy tongue. Now, if that weren't enough, lampreys are also edible, but the mucus of several species of lamprey are known to be toxic and require a thorough cleaning before consumption. Number 4. Mata Mata Turtle Looking at this specific turtle from the front, it looks like a turtle that would teach you how to do kung fu. At the end of an action montage where you mastered the art in the span of five minutes, it would say, you are ready. But while this turtle might not be a ninja turtle, it sure does have crazy fast reflexes. Instead of hunting, Mata Matas wait for their food to come to them, which is helped by the fact that it blends nicely into its surroundings. When a fish approaches them, the turtle stretches their neck out and opens its jaws wide, creating a vacuum-like suction. The fish gets sucked into their mouth at light speed, swallowed whole because this turtle is physically unable to chew. They are not the only ones who exhibit this hunting behavior, though. It can also be observed with snapping turtles. Number 3. Wolverine Frog So, you ever seen a hairy frog? No? Would you want to? No matter your answer, we will show it to you anyway. So buckle up! The hairy frog can be found in many different areas, including the Democratic Republic of the Congo, Nigeria, and Cameroon. It prefers subtropical or tropical forests and plantations, so there is a chance you might come across one there. The hair grows on the males during the breeding season to help them breathe underwater longer, allowing them to guard the unhatched eggs because going to the surface too often may attract predators. You might not believe us, but the hair on this frog isn't actually the weirdest thing about this species. The frog is able to break its own bones to produce claws that puncture through the frog's toe pads to defend itself. Now, you can probably see where the wolverine part of their name comes from. This frog is also called the horror frog, which doesn't need to be explained after we just told you the information about this species. Scientists assume that breaking the bones is a gruesome defense mechanism. What do you think about this? Let us know in the comments down below. Number 2. Thorny Dragon Lizard this next entry on our list is also sometimes referred to as the thorny devil or mountain devil. It is native to Australia. Thinking about it, a lot of dangerous and weird-looking animals are native to Australia. Evolution's playground, some may say. The hard spines on its body help it against predators because, let's be honest, you wouldn't like to eat something thorny like this either. As another defense, it also has a false head on the back of its neck, which is used to deter predators. It sticks its real head between its legs and sticks out the false one. Like this, it might not get wounded as bad in an emergency. Another cool feature on the body of this lizard is its rigid scales, which can collect water between them by simply touching it. A complicated principle called the capillary principle allows the water to be transported to the mouth through the skin. A magnificent but an odd-looking creature. Number 1. Goblin Shark our number one could definitely give us nightmares if we look at it too long. Thankfully, it lives in very deep waters, far away from humans. Not only that, but these sharks feed mostly on fish, crabs, and mollusks. This shark is also said to be a poor swimmer and has bad eyesight, which makes it completely harmless to humans. This is backed up by the fact that there are no reported incidents of goblin sharks attacking humans. Of course, though it may be harmless to humans, that doesn't mean it is any less scary to look at. The shark has the ability to dislocate its jaw in order to be able to catch prey in front of it. It is usually very slow and clumsy, which is why it waits for prey to swim in front of its mouth, which is when it will snap its jaw forward to catch it. Pretty scary looking if you ask us. Thankfully though, no matter how scary this species may be, it is safe from humans, because it lives in dark waters where fishing nets and pollution can't hurt it. And with that lovely entry, we come to the end of our video. We hope you enjoyed learning about these chilling creatures and that you won't have nightmares. Let us know in the comments below what you thought, and go ahead and click on the next video on your screen. See you there!